Uh, we're good on inventory space right now, I think. Yeah, we're good enough. Sort. Sort. No, that's good enough for sorting right now. <gasps> oh, these chairs have, like, a place for you to put cups and things. That's so nice. I want, I want one of these. As I say, as I'm reminded of my own beverage sitting next to me. All right, these Nero mods, I want them. Ooh. Uh. Sorry, I think I hear an alarm behind this wall. <laughs> Maybe leaning it will help me more. Leaning will help me more. Anyway, let's put some more stuff in our eyes. Eh. I could get better at healing myself. Or, there might be some... Yeah, this is what I'm looking for. Increases recycling yield by 20%. That's good. Reduces stamina cost of wrench attacks. That's also good. I could, uh, increase my health. Maybe. Enter a state of combat focus for 10 seconds in which time slows around you. And actions cost 50% of stamina. So it's like an active ability, or is it like passive? Like when does when does this get activated? Do I have to like press a button, or like whenever I enter combat, for ten seconds? Hmm. Mm -hmm. I could get physician and then meta metal metabolic boost. Hmm. Hmm. I say. Or I could wait a little bit and get. One of these. I do really like materials expert though. This is the thing. Getting more stuff from stuff, which means I could craft more stuff. I think I'm gonna get more stuff from stuff. And make the decision before I can regret it. Increases recycling yield by 20%. So now I'll get more stuff from stuff. Huh. No, I want to hack into my own computer. What does this mean? Okay. <laughs> There's a minigame. I should have expected. The hacking skill allows you to bypass security systems, protecting keypads, workstations, and security stations. I guess it's good that I get practice. At higher skill levels, you can hack into robotic systems such as auto turrets and operators. Ooh. To hack, use was sad. To quickly navigate the bitstream to reach the target. Once inside the target, press the prompted button quickly complete the hack. Oh, there I am. Okay, I see the problem here. It's not that bad. X! I can see how that'd be a little difficult, but also it's simple enough to understand. That's, that's like the, uh, the best thing for one of those minigames. Simple, but locker. Simple, but you know, difficult. Like, the, uh, I, I still think, like, the Skyrim and the Fallout lockpicking is, like, the perfect one. Mind if I take this apple, you guys? Thanks. Uh, glue, cannon, ammo fabrication plan. Oh. And a weapon upgrade kit. Press I to go into your inventory to use. I already have two of those. How do I make some glue cannon? Oi. How many do I have? I have 227 right now. I don't think I need to make any. Two plants and two metals. We're good for now. But it's good that I have that. From January to Morgan. You made it. Eel. Uh, to Megalia Illusion. To Morgan. Uh, I still don't know what happened. I've put it behind me, but there's no reason we, still, we can't be civil. You passed me in the hall today and you looked through me. If you're angry at something I did, tell me, and we can talk about it. Pretending you don't even know who I am isn't going to help. We still have to work together. Mika. Do not disturb. So, something happened with Mika. Good morning, Tyler. Our resident counselor, Dr. Cole, would like to inform you some symptoms of disturbed sleep, chronic stress, or anxiety to schedule an appointment in the trauma center. You guys hear the voice? If any of you have any like lingering traumas or whatever, go to the uh, trauma center. They'll 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 fix you up good. Uh, anyways, as I was saying, something happened with Michaela. Mm. Well, 
helped me find out about that. Jason. I recognize. Jason's the guy who we, like, invited us to something? No, we, we, we were, like, cordial with Jason when we went into, like, his room. Which was just outside of ours. Our room is massive compared to others, though. This is right there. Or was right there. Hello? No? Nobody's answering. All right. Enough. Enough of mucking about. Morgan has requested your terminal log set to be automatically forwarded to your new, to your suite and crew quarters, and the supplies from hardware sent up. Let me know if they get to you all right, and if not, it'll get resolved. Like last week. Make sure you aren't disturbed in the interim. Let me know if there's anything else I can do. I'll hold down the, down the fort outside your office. Watch me, Morgan. Hello, Morgan. This LGV file should clear things up. Make sure you're alone when you hit play. I, uh, sorry guys, but I think I'm going to have to stop recording and watch this. <laughs> They'll never find out. Oh man, we're fancy here, aren't we? No, that's not bad. Whatever. Can I show this chair around? Whatever. I'll set up a desk. Oh, no. Hello, Morgan. Tough day, right? If I'm talking to myself, it must be. Your memory shot full of holes, I know. I'm sorry, but it's permanent. So the first thing you need to know is you can trust January. It's an operator, a sort of backup of you and me. It knows what you've forgotten. We've been testing a new kind of neuromod based on the Typhon organisms, mapping their neural patterns onto ours. Yeah, that seems like Problem is, well. when you uninstall a Neuromod, it resets your memory back to the moment you first put it in. That's why you forget. There's supposed to be a process that brings you back up to speed between test runs. But someone could just skip that part. Turn a single day into your entire life. Well, that's exactly what Alex did. The question is, why? You're not going to like what I have to say next. That the string section is getting angry. Well, I thought I found every one of those damn videos. Sorry, but I can't let you listen to that. Not until I've had a chance to explain everything in person. For now, just damn it. I have to go. Just sit tight, please. I'm fighting for my motherfucking life right now. And you're just... Well... 5150. I know where to put that. It... Sorry, Morgan. Alex cut us off from the Looking Glass servers. Time to improvise. I suggest you search Dr. Calvino's workshop in the hardware labs. Mm -hmm. He invented the Looking Glass technology. You might find a way to restore the server connections there. I'm looking for another way to help you in the meantime. Good luck. Thank you. I should have known something was up when in utilities there was repair the server. Threw a glass darkly, huh? Well, hello. Glad I came out here to see that. Do you think I could leap onto that uh, art display? I mean, I can and I'm gonna, but not right now. my secretary. Did I read this? I don't think I read this. Typhon contaminant found. Did you hear screaming? Target no alien material. No, this was Bianca who is friendly. And Sylvain was the one who is friendly. And Jason is... Oh my god. You know what? Ah, sorry, I didn't mean to throw you. Oh, give me. I just need a safe place to hide. Maybe I should go more into like repairing to scan. so I could get more of these guys on my side. Something was really displeased with me. Combat basics. Ah, why would you give me this now? 
Take advantage of your environment and tools in combat. You do not have to fight every enemy head on. Use alternate routes, sneak past tough enemies. If you intend to fight, disabling first with a glue cannon, increase your odds of surviving. Yeah, thanks for uh telling me. I'm gonna leave first and go and input that code. How about that? Probably have this out of instead of not having this out, I guess. I remember slapping you there, so you're nothing. 5150. Oh. Let's go open up that safe in our first area. Did I just see something like shimmer? Huh. Nope. Let's keep this thing out. What is like the size limit on something? that a mimic can become. So can it become something like this? My guess is gonna be no. And of course it's gotten darker in this room. I assume, I assume the safe code is like the one that we found in like the very first room, 5150. I guess there's like a safe downstairs we could check it on. Ah! Alright. Uh. Five. What? I used to wish for one long in the universe. Okay, I'm leaving. <laughs> yeah, it's me. What, you found me out? Yeah, okay, whatever is in there uh, activates the scary music. So, let's just calmly walk back to the first area. I'm leaving. <sighs> also, I have leverage one, which means I can check again. Uh, any things that I... I also have, like, hack and leverage and everything. I also forget to, forget to check the, uh... The keypad, or, like, the, uh, board, watch board or whatever of... Whoever my secretary was. I'm calling them my secretary. Jason! I forgot to check Jason's, uh... Is my path still made? Yep. I could repair you, can I? Eight out of six? That's a lot. J I assume that just repairs these, which I don't need. Eh? Hello. What is this telling me? Like, can I repair this? <laughs> Maybe it's something I don't know about yet. 5150. Just making sure I remember. Weird. Does that display on everything else? No. Aha! Nope. Nope, nope. X. I knew coming back here would be a... Would be a good reason for that. Who is this? Caleb Hawthorns from Alex. A note about this morning. We already read that. Igwe's talk. Tell me about it. I don't know what scares me more. The time Dr. Wiggy spends in the lab or when he takes the stage. It's like listening to a metronome. From Caleb to Hayden to Igwe's talk. I don't know how to pronounce this. Somebody in the comment section, be nice and help me. Uh, that goes for, like, any of the names that I'm mispronouncing, please. I would like pronouncing names correctly. Uh, I'd join you in the cafeteria, but Igwiz lost a lot of uh, lecture struck- got a lecture scheduled. 
Here's hoping he gets right to the Nero mod update so we can do a proper eval on the tech side. But, you know, anyway, you'll go Zener on us if for a, for an hour until we're all seeing circles and wavy lines. You think you would have learned Earthside to stay focused. Got him. <laughs> Thirsty business, having a uh, fighting these guys. Hold on. Ah, every time I'm reminded of like drinking things, I drink something myself because I like coffee. Stand up notes. Ah ha! This was the uh, guy who sent us that email. And also is like our pal. This is them. And that's us. Hold on, I forgot to check files. Uh, fabrication for the Huntress Bolt Caster? Ooh. Change log. I like the idea of a change log for a weapon. I assume this is a weapon. R noise reduction on trigger action. It's a little bit too clacky for my tastes. You know, decreased weight for weight while retaining structural stability. No more barrel splintering. Finalized name to the Huntress Boltcaster. Rejected Clive's suggestion of Pain Thrower. <laughs> and Franklin's Excruciator. I like both of those. Give me. So now I can craft that? I'll need to check. Because I like the idea of a Pain Thrower. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> Right, right. Let me take a quick shower. Anything changed since I was last here? Because I now have ludicrous amounts of weaponry. And by ludicrous, I mean three guns, two guns actually, and one wrench and a grenade. Well, am I going, like, the stupid way around? Now, yeah, whatever. I'll need to come back out this way anyway, so let's just do this. Did I read you? An error has occurred. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. Uh, wait, actually, hold on. Back to the uh, other room. Hold on, which was the one that opens up the uh, the way out? Ugh, hold on. Can I just like climb through? I wanted to get to that 5150. Just remembering. Hold on. I know I, I know I can get down easily. Comfy bed, save me. Yeah. 50. 5150. Rather. This looks. To be the same room, it is. It is. <laughs> five, one, five, oh. Let's go. Three more. Three more Nero mods. Some psi, a psi fabrication plan. No, those, those are just three psi. I thought those were three Nero mods. Oh well, still good. Exotic material, and an O super thermal amp. Oh, this is a new chipset thing. I don't have any place to put it, though. Uh, boost the amount of damage done by Super Thermal. I don't know what that is, and I have no place, place to put it, so it's doubly useless for now. Good to have it for now, though. Glad I came here. Especially because I got the, uh... Crafting thing for... 
This was the camera that was filming us, I think. The chair was like right here or so. God, that's good. That's good. That's so good. This game is so good. Being able to like see that. Oh, oh. This is a good game. I want to be sad when it's over. But when it's over, I could play Moon Crash. I don't know much about Moon Crash. I think it's like a roguelike, and I'll play that, most likely. Now, how do I get out of here? The exit is closed. Wait, hold on. Uh, go to the roof. I'm back. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> The world is taking a while to load, huh? I wonder what would have happened if I had, like, explored over this way and found this. Now, how do I... How do I get out of here? Climb. Thank you. Because I, I remember that up there is like a way to. Oh, hitting my floor just explodes it. Hmm. So, like a. There's no way I'm stuck. This game is, like, too well... Like... Uh, this game is too good to, like, not have a way for me to get out of here. Which means I'm just gonna have to figure it out. Open. Yeah. No. Okay. So I just need to get into this room somehow. Use a path. Will this lead anywhere new or? No, this doesn't really lead anywhere. But I have a funny idea though. I don't know what this is gonna do, but let's do it. That is cool. Oh, that, that, oh. Of course you just be able to break the glass. Oh, my God. I mean, I, I love exploring. I love this game and I love exploring. All right, what else is there? What does the Psy stuff do? I don't know what the use of like the, uh, any of the Psy stuff is. I assume it's for shoe. Anything in here that I didn't like open up? Still don't have the uh, thing for the skill recorder room. Alright, let's awkwardly make our way back up. Fabrication? No. Alright, can I lift this stuff yet? No. I need one more thing of leverage. But I can carry you. Oh! 
It's just like toppled a little bit. Can I throw this with enough force to like knock that thing over? I can like move it around. No, that just like settled it more. Hold on, I can get there. I can get there. Okay, that just missed. And that's it, almost it. Just one more time. Oh! Hello? Oh my god. Alright, so why did I come in here? Am I sequence breaking? That yeah, should be fine if I am. They've, they've thought of everything. So where am I trying to get into? And I shouldn't feel too safe up here. Especially because there's no music. Where do you lead? Locked. From the inside somehow. This is not useful to be up here. Oh, who are you? Wait. There's more. There's more of that sky stuff. Which means... Ugh, am I going to have to, like, walk over the... Because if I fall from up here, I am 100% saving. 100% dead. I hate this, I hate this, I hate this, I hate this. I want to get on solid ground. Oh, wait, hold on. I can also hold F to put my wrench away. Is this the, is this, is this the, uh, that one engine? Junior Bookman. Is that your name? <laughs> What I'm about to do what I'm about to do to you is very funny. Poor it. I could have just crawled underneath here, huh? Oh well. Well, was this whole excursion worth the uh the one point I put into leverage? Probably not. But I got here. It's not like Leverage was a total waste. I'm still going to use it for other things. Also, it's a pathway to get to leverage, too, which is gonna... Okay, so I might have... <laughs> oh. Man, how funny would have that been, huh? Have I made my... I haven't found the thing for volunteer testing yet, either. Okay, so that, that, uh, uh, closed, that locked panel should take us into volunteer quarters, which I have the code for, so it didn't really matter. Where did I find this code? Seven, one, six, four. Oh, no, you shouldn't have. By you shouldn't have, I mean no. I shouldn't have come in this room. <laughs>